Hello dudes, it's me Alana standing here back with some more Windcraft quest guides. And today we're taking a look at Lazarus Pit. It's a level 69 long quest. Talk to Berter at those coordinates. So, I believe that Berter is right over here. We're starting in Gelleboard. Coordinates right on the screen, but also in your quest book. So, let's talk to Berter and see what he has to say. Uh, hello human, I'm afraid you should keep your distance from me. I have a terminal illness, kerasat poisoning. It's a fungal infection in the throat. I'm afraid I don't have long. The forest here has changed. It used to be just like the southern forest. Light, green, lush. But now it's nothing but decaying trees. My grandfather told me there wasn't anything in the forest you couldn't eat. Now you're lucky to find a sing single edible thing. Something has happened to disturb the balance here. Everything is in decline. Alas, I will not be around to see the forest restored, if it is, if it ever is. Unless, of course, you can help me. Knowing my illness, I read upon anything that could save me, and apparently there is a pool of water in your homeland wind somewhere in the forest. I'll die before you make it there and back, but if... It reminded me of a similar pool near here. I don't know where it is, but an old townsman did. He said he he would take his secret to the grave, and I believe he meant literally. Literally. I, I don't like that word. Literally. He asked specifically for his tomb to have all sorts of odd numbers on it. Go this to his grave just north of here and see if you can figure out his riddle. Please hurry, I don't have much time. Wow, he's talking about a pool of healing water, and I just did Grand Youth, where you go to the Winds Fountain of Youth. So, we're gonna go over to the grave, which is right back over here, and uh, see what the weird numbers are. So I just think that, yeah, we need a quest book update. Those are coordinates. And yeah, you don't need to read them. You just really need to know where to go, which is north from the grave. A bit to the west as well, till you find this tower, which you need to climb. Coordinates right there, but you know, you don't really need them if you know where to go. Did we start at the bottom again? Feels like we did. Okay, jump. Okay, follow the carpets. And we come on. Up, up, up we go. Look at this. And it just says that we need to go over here. Let's see, we gotta go up in this tree. Okay. Step on that, go down. Enter this cave. Do this parkour, remember this. Red, red, yellow, yellow, and then blue. Okay. Red, red, yellow. Okay, remember that. Head back. Go up. Press. Go down. And go over here. So red, red, yellow, blue, and green. Boom. Enter. Go through this hidden door. And talk to Vestar. Oh, hello. I didn't think anyone would ever open that door. Well, welcome, I guess. What do I have to say to get rid of you? I've been hiding down here for decades, ever since Mr. Dullahan lost his head and went crazy. I have feared for my life. I know I look very young. You see, I was able to... 
procure some water from a pool that grants eternal youth. I won't give you any of my water. I want to live forever, but I can't tell you where to go where to go to get some of your own. I want to go personally, some prison warden and thought it was a good idea to bury the dead there, and the water has brought them back. It is teeming with the revived corpses of prisoners. In fact, I should really make sure you can handle it. I don't want you to send to your death, so kill some rejuvenated corpse and bring me 16 rotten skin from the monsters around the pond east of here. Do that and I'll tell you where it is. Oh yeah, I forgot about the pawn and all, but um, I know where it is. Just I forgot that you need to do that for this quest. So we gotta go over to this area close to the Dalian prison and kill these guys. Let's see, we needed 16. Not that. Oh wait, yes, rotten skin. That is what we want. Grab it all. Should actually put up a totem so it goes to the uh, wrong one. Okay, now. Now we can do this for real. Come on, grab. Oh, wait, what was that? The foot. Well, let's just kill these guys. Does the totem actually help? Not sure. Stitch it. Stitched flesh. We just need the um oh stitched legs. Their legs walking or oh foot feet as well. Wand can grab that, but we just need skin. Let's see, we need sixteen, so a few more. Six more. Wrong mob. See, 12. <clears throat> These feet are getting everywhere. Oh. Grab a bit more. Let's see, 13. Can't drop anything. Oh, these night lurkers are. They can go invisible, so you can't see them. Stitched flesh. I don't want that. Drop no, no drops. Come on. Seriously, there's one. Kill it. Yep, he dropped. It should be at 14, and these two should suffice. Have that and this, and we are done. Yep. Even got a bit more than needed. Need me. Yeah. Anyways, head back to the house. And red, yellow, come, come on, and blue and green. We did that all. Okay. Well, anyways, head down and give the flesh to Vestar. Welcome back. Well, I guess I should tell you where the pit is then, although I still think it's unwise. Enter the mountain to the east and climb to the top. There you will find a pool. Just jump right in. Let's keep this between us, okay? We don't want too many mortal men, especially as we've seen what happened to, uh, what happens when the wrong men get their hands on it. Good luck. Okay. I just drop this. And go to the, well, the gavel fountain of you. Let's see. So, to the mountain in the east. Which is this mountain next to Gelleboard. Head through this cave and go to the top. Gotta take a right and continue. And we 
shall soon be at the pool. And now, drop down. Boom. Teleport. Fall down. Lasaurus Pit. Gavel's counterpart of Wind's Fountain of Youth. The Lasaurus Pit has been resurrecting the dead inmates of the nearby prison. So, we gotta make our way towards this endless hole of doom. Oh god. Go over to this house. Scorch here if you if I went too fast. Talk to C Sad. Who who are you? Did the pit raise you from the dead? I've been living down here for I don't even know how long now. A few years ago, bodies began roaming the cave. I had to put up defenses and I've been down here ever since. It'll be nice to have some company for once. Wait, you're not staying? This is the only pit in Gavel. You should stay and live forever. I've heard there was only one in each province, but I'm not sure if it's true. Well, here, take this water. I guess I owe you for the limited comp company you gave me if you want to find the way out there's a path behind my house that leads to the exit so grab the healing water no it's not liquefied emeralds and it does not work as liquefied emeralds and go just right behind his house towards this exit and teleport drop down and go to Berter. Here's your healing water. Who are you? Oh, you made it! Come on. Is that the water? I can't believe it. Will it cure me? Berter takes the bottle and gulps down the water. Woo wee! That is actually the stuff of dreams. Maybe this forest isn't so dead after all. You really saved my life, human. I owe you big time. Take this, it's all I can spare. And quest completed, Lazarus Pit. 500,000 experience points. 1,024 emeralds. That is 16 emerald blocks and one Lazarus Brace, which is this bracelet. And that was it for Lazarus Pit, everyone. Goodbye.